All right. Welcome, welcome. Let's see what we got going here. Let's see. I'll do a little screen capture here. Uh, just the desktop. Just to get us going. All right, what we're doing is a uh, picked up a SSD. I had a, a standard SSD that I've been running for about a year or so, and it's a I believe it's an 840 uh, Samsung 840 Ego e Ego. Ooh, it's late. Ah oh, man, it's about one o'clock in the morning. It's an 840 Evo, and what I switched to was a 960 Evo. That's a um, NVMe. Uh, M2 SSD and what this is here is I'm going to do a little video I'm going to try to do a little split screen and show the difference in speed between the two and what we do is uh, fire it up from um, sleep or not sleep but uh, totally off fire up the computer and then load up steam and then jump into Borderlands which was on the standard SSD and then I have it on my uh, NVMe as well now so um, get this split screen all set up here and uh We'll get rolling. All right. <clears throat> Let's see. Both fired up. And the one on the right is the NVMe. One on the left is the standard SSD. Both kind of started out the same. Second uh, ROG, ROG screen and NVMe is up, running. It's already in Windows. Good to go. And already got Steam loaded. And Borderlands is going. Standard SSD is still going through the Windows screen. There's the welcome screen. The NVMe doesn't even give it a chance to see that welcome screen. <laughs> and there it is. Borderlands is just starting on the other one. That's not, I mean, it's, gosh, I wish I had a comparison of a regular uh, disk hard drive. I can't even imagine. Because the SSD, the standard one, is fast anyway. But compared to the other, uh, the new, holy crap. And it's up and running. Borderlands is up on the NVMe. Second one is still waiting. Pretty freaking quick. And it's not even maxed out. I need to adjust some settings and stuff. But anyway, thanks for watching, and uh, there's my uh, comparison.